CHOP researchers' new findings support novel therapy for disabling bone disease. Researchers at Children's Hospital Philadelphia have taken a big step toward a novel therapy for hereditary multiple exostosis, a rare disabling pediatric genetic bone disease. Tumors called osteochondromas, or exostosis, form along children's and teens' growth plates, which are the engines of bone lengthening. Because of the tumor's large number, size, and locations, they can cause many health problems such as bone deformities, slowed growth, interference with nerves and blood vessels, impaired motion, and chronic pain. Sometimes, osteochondromas can increase children's cancer risk and become life-threatening. Currently, no drug treatments are available for HME. Dr. Maurizio Pacifici, a developmental biologist and director of orthopedic research at Children's Hospital Philadelphia, made an important discovery in 2013 that a biological pathway regulating bone formation is altered in HME. His lab's research showed that hyperactivity of the bone morphogenetic protein signaling pathway caused osteochondromas. In healthy children, a sugar polymer called heparin sulfate keeps the BMP pathway in check. But children with HME have a genetic mutation that leads to a deficiency of heparin sulfate. This lack of heparin sulfate allows BMP activity to ramp up and then osteochondroma formation occurs in tissues near the growth plate. These laboratory observations were crucial because for the first time they gave researchers a specific target for drug therapy. In April 2017, Dr. Pacifici's team reported that drugs able to block the BMP pathway stopped osteochondroma formation in animal models of HME. This is encouraging news because the team has already identified one such drug, palivaratine, that is being tested in a clinical trial for patients with another severe pediatric skeletal disorder called fibrodysplasia ossificans progressiva. If palivaratine turns out to be safe and effective for both FOP and HME, it could mean that clinicians would be able to treat children early in life before these debilitating diseases progress and elicit many and complex health problems.